everyone how are you guys doing today in today's video i am going to be saying some positive affirmations and before i start this video just let me say that um, some people might think that positive affirmations are kind of silly at one time i thought that they were kind of silly too but they actually can help to make you feel better and I just think there's a lot of power in what we say and what we think about ourselves even if um, well anyway I'm getting ahead of myself but these are designed to help you relax help you to feel better and I just kind of covered some general topics that are things that I appreciate as well and I have them written down already my notebook and this notebook in particular it's a, a sketchbook but um, I just like to write down things that make me feel good and <laughs> do you want to see a picture <laughs> that I drew of myself I don't know it's kind of funny you might kind of laugh but um, anyway, <laughs> I drew a self-portrait, but uh, I actually modeled it off of the picture from uh, Nightcrawler from X-Men Evolution, not the regular X-Men, but X-Men Evolution Nightcrawler, because I think I kind of look like him a little bit. It's, it's a cartoon, but anyway, I'm going to go ahead and get into these positive affirmations for you guys. <clears throat> this year will be the best year yet. My best days are ahead of me. Something that Joel Olstein says a lot. <laughs> Everything around me is working out for my good. All I have to do is relax and enjoy it. I am not anxious for anything. I have enough money to live a good life and my income is always increasing. Money makes its way to me. Struggle and toil are in the distant past. Every day is fun and enjoyable. Each and every day I am pleasantly surprised. I live in an abundant world and the world is exponentially opening up to me. My home is welcoming to me. It both gives me energy and comfort. What I need, what I need is drawn to me within the moment that I need it. I'm meeting the right people for me and it feels like I've known them all of my life. I have the time, the freedom, and the resources to do what I want to do. I wake up in the morning and get out of bed because I'm looking forward to my day ahead of me. Miracles happen to me every day, yet they still amaze me more and more every time. The world opened up to me, and every step I take is secure in creating a better life for me. 
money finds its way into my life, I find myself being pleasantly surprised because I am always receiving additional and more money than I had expected. Money comes to me easily, effortlessly, and unexpected. My body is in perfect health, and I feel pleasantly and easily driven to become even better each day. I look in the mirror each day, and I am pleased with what I see. I would want to be me, even if I weren't already me. I love myself and my life. My life is so much fun. Dread and disappointment are things in the distant past. The right people are in my life, and the people I don't need are leaving. I hardly even notice them leaving, but before I know it, they're gone. Everything is working together for my individual good. Everything is happening around me, and I am well taken care of. When I think about God and how he aligns the stars and the planets, it actually seems impossible that my life will be anything less than a miracle, and I am meant to enjoy it every day. Thank you guys for watching. Those were just a few quick but uh, meaningful to me positive affirmations that I had written down and I want to encourage you guys um, I made a video uh, an ASMR video titled something like how to become the person you want to be and I'll link that video below in that video I talk about positive affirmations and things like that, and, you know, it's, like I said at the beginning of the video, it might seem silly to some people, like, oh, what does saying something have to do with anything? Some people might feel like they're lying, because they might feel like they're saying something that's not true, but the way that I think of it is, everything is energy, and everything is, like, get too, I don't want to sound like I'm too out there or anything like that, but think about it, everything is constantly moving, even like this notebook, we look at it, we say it's solid, but if you were to look at it under a microscope, there's actually like all the cells and everything, it's, everything is constantly emo in motion, and our thoughts are actual physical things, our thoughts you know, we think of our thoughts, we think of some, them as something that doesn't really exist or something that doesn't really have any significance or anything like that. But the truth is our thoughts are really powerful. And like I said in my uh, video that I'm linking, that I'm going to link below, a good thought and a bad thought physically look different inside your brain. And I think it's important to feel good at all times and to enjoy the process of life. And I think it's important to guard our minds from, from doubt, from worry, from fear. Um, because I believe that the things that we think and the feelings that we, that we feel, and you have to train your emotions to feel how you want to feel, and that's where 
these type of affirmations come along. TJ Maxx, seven ninety nine. <laughs> I'm just laughing because I saw the sticker. Sometimes people wake up in the morning and they might wake up in a bad mood, but and then they might just go with it and they say, "Oh, I'm in a bad mood today. It's just a bad day." But really, you have to train your emotions and how you feel because um, that's a very important and impactful tool to living the best life that you can live. And, you know, maybe you don't believe some of these affirmations, but try to just have fun with it. Just let yourself daydream a little bit, but in the right direction. Oftentimes, when when we were kids, we used to daydream about fun things and things that we enjoyed. And then as we grew up and went through different situations in life, we started to, to daydream, but about things that we were worried about and what if. What if this happens, and worst case scenario, and so on and so forth, and we sort of let, our, let the fear take over our minds, and oftentimes live in a state of worry more than we realize. So it's important to turn that around. I was watching Joel Olstein on TV the other day on Sunday, and he was talking about guarding your mind, guarding your imagination, and he had an example of changing the channel in your mind. You know, if you have a thought of, of fear and poor health that pops in your mind, change the channel to um, enjoying your loved ones or, you know, the channel of seeing yourself in good health. And you might think that it's not really significant, but actually has a lot more <laughs> significance than most people realize and anyway I just want to help you guys as I help myself as well because I need to hear things like this and write things down because uh, it makes me feel better and it should be fun you know you don't want to like try too hard if you try too hard sometimes then that's not always good but just I think the most important thing is to have fun you know if you're if you're having fun in my opinion opinion with like doing affirmations then that means that you're doing it right so just relax and don't put pressure anyway I could say a lot more but maybe I will in another video but until next time I'll talk to you guys later bye everyone